What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, King Dow. Shout out to my guy, Crazy Matt Productions, behind the camera. We go way back. So this is going to be the first video breakdown where I break down all my music videos from start to now. And the reason why I wanted to start doing this is because I want to give all you guys who have been supporting me over the years a more in-depth process visually to what I've been doing and how I got to where I am now. I think it's important and this would just give us something to, you know, have something fun to do, how to interact, show you guys another part of myself so you understand my process, get to know me more as a person, as an artist, and so you get to understand why everything I do in this music is very important to me. So thank you for being here. Thank you for supporting. We're going to get started. This is the first music video breakdown. We're going to break down my time. Now, my time was the first song. It was the first music video, and it was also the first album that I ever put together. Back in 2018 was when I started my journey as King Dao. That's when everything was created. Shout out to my guy, Jonathan Bumpus. I went to college with him and he was the first producer that I worked with who gave me uh, an instrumental that became the song, My Time. You know, I used to freestyle a lot in high school, in college. And then he was just like, hey man, we need to start making this music for real. And so like after we graduated, he sent me the, the instrumental. I heard it, I loved it, I wrote to it. He sent it back to me. And mind you, this is when I was basically just sending my vocals back and forth with him. He lived in New York, he was getting his degree out there. And I didn't have like an in-person engineer. So that's how we did it for a few years. When he sent me back my vocals, I was like, whoa, like it's like an outer body experience. You know, I don't know if you guys have ever heard yourself when you like record yourself or something but when you first hear yourself like singing or whatever it's like it's a manifestation of you your voice it resonated with me i recorded it i dropped it on soundcloud you know people react a lot of friends i think got like a thousand plays people reacted very well to it i remember i was a tutor at the time you know shout out to my avid tutor days shout out to all the students you already know and a lot of kids went crazy sharing that stuff around that too i was like all right bet i need to make a music video my guy zach purnell shout out to him i went to high school with him he was getting his start as a videographer he was like showing his services i think he had like the skeleton of his website i heard that he did video so i reached out to him i was like yo bro uh you do videos right he's like yeah of course and i'm like yo i want to do this music video can we get together he said yes and so basically we got together i told him my idea about how i just want to make a music video of me just you know dancing and just like showing like yo this is my time this is my time to shine this is the first single i'm dropping this is the first music video people are going to see and this is like the start of something great and I just want to showcase like all of me at that time, all my confidence in that. He was down for it. We drove all the way to Alki Beach because we live in Seattle, Washington. For those who don't know, Seattle, Washington, shout out to the PNW, you already know. We went to Seattle and we went to Alki Beach to film it. We filmed the video under a bridge. We also filmed it at the beach itself. There's like construction sites in the video. If you go watch it, you know, there's like, I think it was like a white Porsche we found. I was wearing like a white jacket with like black sleeves on it, looking like Michael Jackson or some shit. It was just great. It was a sunny day. It, it was like the whole experience was just like mind boggling. I remember one thing when we started, he told me like, Zach, shout, and this is why shout out to Zach. He's a dope director. I want to get him in on one of these, uh, as many as these like videos that I do every time. So you guys can get to hear his perspective on working with me he's still my videographer that i work with today the first video he gave me was amazing and we've just been like skyrocketing like to higher levels visually i always say like you always want to find someone who's you if you were to produce for yourself if you were to dj for yourself he's definitely me if i was to make videos for myself and so that video was so crisp he, always, he told me like at the beginning like yo don't lip sync because it comes off like people can tell so he got me like actually like singing my lyrics as we're recording when we're like under the bridge like it's loud people are going by it's windy but we're just like staying focused i'm tapped in you know like i'm dancing i'm like like and it's a lot of energy people don't know if, if you let's say if you go to a club or a concert and you're like jumping up and down seeing the lyrics with like your favorite artist right you're gonna get tired 10 times that when you're a dancer and you're like you're dancing moving and all this energy and you have to do it multiple times multiple takes over and over until you get it right you know zach would always say yo the camera loves you because like he could never get a bad shot of me according to him it was a lot of fun we did that and uh we went on the beach the film there it was a hot day and we got a lot a lot of good uh behind the scenes footage that i actually put into my uh documentary that you can go check out uh link down below the dow doc um that also is going to have many of the videos that we're going to be talking about small clips of it that showcase that journey of like the behind the scenes but again these videos that we're doing now are going to give you more in depth that the documentary documentary doesn't give you but still check out the documentary and you can still see what i'm talking about because a lot of these clips are also in that too we, we did it uh under the bridge we did it at the beach did multiple takes it was great got some food while we were out there you know we dropped that video natch organically i think by itself i think it got like 
almost a thousand views if i'm not mistaken this is before i knew anything about marketing and all that people reacted to it very well and i just i looked at it and i was like yo this is what i'm going to be doing forever uh, I, I just already knew like like all, immediately i think like we just start working on other ideas i had like because that was my first song ever on any platform and then i dropped a couple other songs on soundcloud and then one more single i think by my fourth single that we will talk about in the next video uh the movement which also becomes a part of this whole my time album because as i mentioned earlier the my time was the album um essentially the music video and the single my time were the catalyst to that full project if you check out the video guys like it, it's like i have yet to see anyone in the pnw and shout out to a lot of the local people but like in terms of like that quality that color grading that zach has done shout out to zach i learned what color grading was from you know working with him and that's the beautiful thing when you're working with a director a videographer who knows what they're doing you guys can bounce off each other you know you start to understand the lingo you start to understand what b-roll is for those of you who don't know b-roll is behind the scenes or it could be just like different like you know candid shots of like the scenery and stuff that you can put into video so i learned all this terminology from us working on the my time video all the way up to all the over 20 videos we have together another thing that i learned during that time when we shot that video is how much time goes into the editing process because there's multiple th things that i did in that video that didn't make it but there was a lot of things that i did do that did make it and that's a beautiful thing when you're an artist behind the camera it's important for you to make sure that you take as many as the best takes that you can so then your videographer it's easy all they got to do is pick the best one that makes the most sense you guys will see like all my different from like my my windmill kicks to like you know slide and moon walk moon walking all these different things uh because i just wanted to show i am a all-around full-time multi-talented artist i can dance i can sing and i can just basically bring a presence and that's what my time was like it's my time to shine it's my time to show what i can do because my past has brought me all the way up until this point you know i'm also a bass player eventually later on down the line you start to see a lot of my co-production in my music in my music videos as well that we'll talk about later and i knew i was also going to go in this direction even back then you know it was always in the back of my mind but you always got to start small right and so i understood okay in the beginning i have to show what i can do what what are my strengths right now what I can show the people now and what I'm ready for. Cause I was finally ready. I always knew as a young kid that I wanted to be a solo artist, but it was just a matter of time for, for me to get the confidence, the support, and ultimately for me to say, okay, let's do this. And so that was it back in 2018 when I created the song, I think in that January and in the spring when I dropped that music video, I want to say it's my birthday month. April is when we dropped it. The rest is history from there. If you guys have any questions, feel free to drop the comments down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what other videos you want me to talk about, other music videos, all that. This is the first breakdown that we have. Shout out to my guy Crazy Mike behind the camera. You know, I want to do this every week, a couple weeks, but... We're gonna do this all the way up until we get to where we are now. Again, it's your boy King Dow. This has been the, been the My Time music video breakdown. More to come. Blessings. Peace. Mm -hmm.